I have Danny um, Savala sitting next to me, uh, our lawyer. And um, what did you think of that whole thing? It's getting stranger and stranger by the minute. Yeah. I mean, what I took away from that press conference was this. They're essentially saying, the authorities, these Olympians were not robbed. But somebody may have come up to them with a firearm and demanded money. Possible extortion, they said, perhaps. Well, that's robbery here in the United States. You know, gun plus demand for money is robbery. Even if you think you have some civil right to that money, if somebody wrecked your bathroom, I get it. We have civil ways of getting that money back. Typically here in the United States, one of the options that would not be sanctioned by your local police is, yeah, he owed me 20 bucks, so I went over to his house with a gun and demanded he sit down on the ground and pull out his wallet and peel off wads of money. It's just, it seems very strange right now because the video as it is seems to back up the story that for some reason, these guys who were acting boorish and aggressive suddenly mm -hmm. became very cowed and very demure and sat down on a sidewalk and that there may have been a firearm involved. Look, I'm not defending boorish, uh, obnoxious, frat guy behavior. Uh, I'm not, you know, I mean, these guys may have been acting horribly, but it seems a little inconsistent that Brazilian authorities are suggesting that it's impossible a robbery occurred, but conceding that somebody may have used a firearm to extract right. money from someone's person. Right.